all of the Celtic countries are represented at this inter-Celtic festival and uh, the small of them I suppose has to be the Isle of Man but there is a representative here from the Isle of Man and this is Colin Jerry. Um, how many people all together on the island Colin? It's uh, 65 to 70,000 now. It's grown quite recently and uh, out of those something like 35% are actually Manx born <clears throat> but then if you added on all the other Celts who live there from Ulster, from Ireland, uh, from uh, Wales, etc., the Scots, uh, I dare say the actual majority of Celts, it would be a majority of Celts living there. But what about um, music and song? What form does it take? Um, it's not very easy to classify. It's very much its own thing. That There are certain tunes which we think may resemble uh, perhaps Welsh tunes, Irish tunes certainly. We have some tunes in common with Scotland, but the, the largest body of Manx tunes, uh, I, I suspect is very old because at least a quarter of them are either in Ray mode or La mode, and we have very few, funnily enough, in So mode. Um, they are very much their own thing. A lot of them, <coughs> excuse me, a lot of them were what we call carvel tunes, uh, they would have been very, very old tunes to which words were composed in the early 1700s when they had the Bible published in Manx. There was a great outburst of um, native poetry on religious themes. Uh, there's, uh, there's a very large collection which uh, put together by Dr John Clegg at the turn of the century, which is lodged in the museum in Douglas, and I transcribed all of those and uh, many other tunes too from that were collected by A.W. Moore and latterly by Mona Douglas. So there's a total of something more than 400 tunes, which is a fair number. Um, supposing, somewhere in Dublin, supposing someone now were in Dublin and they decided to take a boat across to the Isle of Man in search of a session, would they find it? Uh, yeah, well, your safest bet is uh, Saturday night in Peel at the White House. There's been a session running either there or the Central for more, close on 20 years now, which is virtually 100% Manx. Well, now, you, I know, have an interest in the Ellen Pipes, but you also sing, and you're going to give us a song now, and maybe introduce it in the, the, the Gaelic or the language of, of the Isle of Man. Fodum, fodum, she. Tena rain shore, sorch de paja rishin, shan g kelcha, them sit manan in beg machalia, te chit rish on skeelan, on sin fobla, on sin air, and yes. Man and then big Mac a leer, Man and then big Mac a leer, Banny or in us no meddin, Man and then big Mac a leer, My gold Mac is no shed shit stack, Man and then big Mac a leer. Lesh na blue is na meru on g man an an big makalia man an an big makalia shane beautiful what was it about well uh, <coughs> the old celtic sea god um, known in uh, wales as manawithin is the uh, legendary king of the isle of man manan manan an big makalia <coughs> who also of course appears in irish stories and it's a kind of an invocation uh, to him to uh, prosper the fishing. Uh, the last uh, little bit of a refrain, no, the last little bit of a verse I sang is, well uh, I'll give you the whole lot for goodness sake, uh, bless us and our boats, um, good going out, even better coming back with the living and the dead on board, the living being the men and the dead being the fish. <laughs> <laughs> 